now, Niklas Dorsch. That's after the banger he scored against Köln, leading his team Osberg to the 2 nil victory. We will be reviewing this card in game. We will be building a squad around this card and seeing exactly is he a complete or is he is he a pass. If you're new on this corners, you know how it goes. Drop a like, subscribe to the channel. Let me know if you're enjoying a few experience at the moment. Let's start with where we start. This is a German international. He is five foot ten. He has played for a number of Bundesliga clubs. His whole entire career has been at the in the Bundesliga. He has played for Bayern Munich uh, two, Bayern Munich the main team as well. He has played for Ghent or Gent in the Belgium league, uh, and he is now playing for FC Osberg, where he has done nineteen appearances. We move on to the to what we have on the screen here. He's five foot ten, medium medium, three star scale, four star weak foot. That is okay. The face value of the guard, he does look pretty. good good i'm not gonna lie uh moving on to the player attributes 95 acceleration against 81 spring speed 86 would be good but there's a big difference between the two even though we do like that acceleration of 95 the shot power is good 81 positioning you should put him in an attack positioning he has 90 shot power um only 80 long shot and 77 volley i will try him today in a a, a cam position i will try him as a cm as well and lastly as a cdm just just for the kick of it the passing is at 91 vision very good 96 short pass 90 long pass that is sensational the dribbling is boosted 93 overall I love the 98, 99 uh, balance and agility. That 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 gives me crazy vibes. That gives me very very agile, very very nimble on the ball. He is average body type. Keep that in mind. We will see in game how that transpires. A uh, 90 reaction, 94 ball control, 91, 91 composure. And I have played with this guy in the arena just to give him a try, and he does move very very nicely. 90 defending awareness, 93 standing tackle, a uh, 90 uh, slide tackle. That is very good for a CDM. The heading accuracy is not there, but he also is able to jump right 96 stamina the whole game 86 strength and 97 aggression of course we know what this card also tells us it's a green link with our Kali Judy he dives into the tackle we absolutely love that he has flair he's also a technical dribbler that tells me that he is going to be able to move within those spaces Bundesliga for the last one you need to submit one Bundesliga uh, card 85 team chemistry 65 65 team chemistry, 85 team overall. On the other one, you do have to submit one German player, 84 overall, 70 chemistry. The chemistry is a little bit higher here. It's a 4 4 1 1. So a bunch of midfielders and a few forwards, and you should be able to complete that. Let's complete exactly that, and we will jump right into the game. Let's go. This is the first team we will be playing um, our Niklas Deutsch, and this is SQ squad. Uh, wow, looking like a lot of nimble players. Okay, let's see how he moves, first of all. Let's see how he moves. Okay, very interesting. He's, he's, uh, yeah, the movement is nice. The turn of the left stick. Let's see if he can beat this guy. Yes, he can. Can he beat that guy as well? Let's go. Can he do that one? Good. Good. Oh, nice. Ooh, can he go through? Can he? Oh, I thought maybe his body could, uh, could show a lot more strength there. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Breakout pace. Come on. Good stuff. Good stuff. Pass it back. Can you fall? <gasps> what a nice build. What a nice build. And Nkunku misses that. That was very interesting. He's in that formation with the five at the back and having him a very high and having him high up is it's actually very interesting right here. I am. I, I have control of him. Wow. Look at that. He was able to get that ball from a run from a straightforward run. Oh, can he get that? Can he get that? Oh. Okay, where's our Deutsch? Come on, pace, 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 pace. What is that Costa doing there? But it's okay, we take it, we shoot. Positioning from Deutsch though, very nice positioning. He's able to go back and to position quite, quite fast there. You saw him covering that wing again there. Um, I like it. Look, look at, look at how close he is. He came right back and he's going to do that pass quickly. Lovely stuff. Lovely stuff. Let's, let's give him the ball again. Can he beat that? Yes, he can. Can he long shot those? Yes, he can. Oh my jeez. Come on. Did you see that long shot of dreams? Hey, I'm, I'm pleasantly sur He gets that. No, that was my fault though. Come on. Is he going to do that run for us? Yes. And he has the pace. And he has the pace. Can he do that pass? No. 
Okay, it was running a little too too strong with them, to be fair. Our uh, Niklas is surprising us a lot right now. Very, very surprised by the... Okay, you see how high he is there? Even though he's a medium, medium. He's able to... I didn't even apply an instruction on him or anything. And he's still able to read those. Um, okay, that's a foul. That's a foul, but he manages to get out of it. Can he see him? No, he can't. But br brilliant set of passes there. Um, da Costa. Who is that? That's Deutsch. Come on. Can he curve those? Can he curve those? He can curve those. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. He's on the score sheet. He's on the score sheet. Okay, so now let's move into the uh, attacking uh, formation, which is a 4 on 2 one 2 and he's now playing as, as a right CM. So let's just see how he's able to, to play. Oh, man, he's playing very well. So the earlier for, the earliest formation, the first one we started in, I think he's he's quite impressive in that formation. I'm not going to lie. Uh, let me just go back to that formation. It's exactly this one. 5 2, two one. Sensational. He's able to go up and go down. He understands. There's no instructions put on him, but he understands where he has to be and at what time, which is actually very impressive. He does the runs. I don't trigger all of the runs that he's, he does, and he still does them. Where is he right now? Where is he right now? Is, is that him? Is that him? Is that him? And again, a brilliant long shot. Can that go in? No, that's not going to go in. I'm going to give you these quick thoughts because I played at the with the five at the back and him playing as a, a, a CM, but a CM playing very much high up, right below the striker. And I feel like that is his natural position because he's able to he's able to shoot. Right now, playing him in a 4 one 2 one 2 second variation as a left CM, um, I do feel like he's, you lose a little bit of his potential because you don't see him as high up the pitch as you would uh, in a five at the back formation. This guy is a CM, a pure CM that needs to play higher up the pitch and provide that medium medium because he does the run forwards, he does the run downwards. Let's let's try him a little bit more and the uh, the four on two and two, and then we'll see if he's still not uh, as felt as he was and and at the start. Come on, Dosh. Good run, good run from him there. Honestly. Oh, that's a goal. That's a goal. We're a little focused on him right now. Let me find him. There he is. Okay, there he is. Okay, perfect. So, let's see if he's uh if he has Let's see. Let's see. There you go. He does a nice pass right there. He's on the other side there. I'm just having a look at him to see how he's moving up there. Oh, I see him right there. Is he going to do that run? Yes, he does. No, I was I was trying to do a little curve there, but uh it didn't it didn't come out fast enough. Look at that. Fantastic. Can they curve that in? Oh, so close. So close. Coming off of a, a nice build from him. I do appreciate that. I do appreciate that a lot. That was very nice from him. Let's go back into this. Where is he? He's right there. He gets the ball. He's able to shoulder pretty much everybody off there. Can he find that pass? He does find that pass. Like I said, when he's... When he's further away from the goal, you feel like you're missing something. You feel like you're missing something. So now I'm going to try him as a CDM. In a two CDM formation. Give that a try and see what that does. There you go. He's able to get that pretty easily. He's able to get that pretty easily. Can, can Reiner score that bigger? He can! He can! And I think that was from a brilliant pass. That was off of a brilliant pass from... Uh, Lovely stuff from Dorch. Listen, I'm so so pleased by this Dorch right now. Let's let's send him a little higher up. Let's see what happens. Can he get that one? Yes, he's good in the air. So he's good in the air. That's good to. That is good to note. We sent that ball in the air, and he still was able to win that. Look at that turn. Look at that turn, and then he's able to lead the attack. Can he get that back? And he falls right back where he was. I did trigger that run. I did trigger that run. Is he able to beat them there? He is. Can he find that ball? And then Witzel. And Witzel is able to get it. Let's go, Dortch. Hey, coming off a beautiful pass again from the man, Dortch. Look at this guy. He is the 
even from this from the CDM position, he is master assisting right now. Wow, I am I am thoroughly thoroughly impressed. Again, wonderful as a CDM, wonderful as a uh, but not a lone CDM. I don't think a lone CDM because once you have him, you almost wanna you almost you almost feel very tempted to use all of that size he offers you. Come on, right now we do see you. We do see you. Is he up? Did he come up? No, he didn't. Okay, he didn't come. There he is. There he is. There he is. Oh, he's not able to win that. I did compromise our formation a bit there. I'm not going to lie. He's amazing up top as a, uh, a center mid in a two center mid formation. He's amazing, right? And like I say, I almost want this guy to play right below the striker. I don't want him to be a cam, of course. But I want him to play right below the strikers, which is why the five at the back formations that offer two CMs is very, very interesting. Let's look at the player performance just to wrap this up and just see how effective he was around the pitch. Dorsch had one goal out of three, one assist out of three. Okay, he had 67 shot accuracy. You're so good on long range. Thank you so much, Akirim. Um, he had 67 shot accuracy, 86 dribbling accuracy, so he can actually complete those dribbles. 87 pass accuracy. He was so good. He did uh, He did 13.7 uh, 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 kilometers on an average, as opposed to 11.3 for the team's average. That is good. So he does work for the entire team. Tim and I really felt his presence, but mostly, like I say, in a 2CM formation there with five at the back, he was so good because you saw him, you felt him. He can dribble, he can pass the ball. He has the strength to shoulder off the players when he is once he's on a shoulder-to-shoulder -shoulder duel. He does have that one. Sensational. A 5-2-2-1, and he played very high. Right here is where you want him. Right behind the center the, the striker. Because once he has that ball, he's gonna bury, he's gonna be able to shoulder off all of the defenders and really launch that attack, providing a lot more support to a more offensive uh directed CM. Love this guy. This was your FIFA Carmina. Drop a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch you all very soon for another one. Peace out.